Hi Roronis, this is your pal Roroni K95 here. So today we're here to show you how I put some DVDs and Blu-rays onto your PlayStation 4. The next one I'm going to start off with is Allegro Non Tropa, for example, on your PlayStation 4. Because my PlayStation 4 Jet Black play, slip, DVD, oh, no, no, Blu-ray, no, no. Yeah, game system, PlayStation 4, plays both DVDs and Blu-rays, for example. So let's begin with this tutorial, you guys. Here we go. Right along with my Blu-ray of The Road Warrior. Let's begin. Here we go. Okay, so I'm here to put on my Legro Non Tropo DVD disc in here. Let's see how this goes. Before I get a chance, before I do mine, the Road Warrior, which is the sequel to Mad Max on Blu-ray, onto your PS4. So this is my PS4 content. Okay, it just says DVD. Start the the disc image thing is all blank, but it just says DVD. Let's see what it does. This is how you do when you set up your when you put in a DVD in your game system which is your PlayStation 4 okay let me pause that here here's the DVD menu in other words because this is like out of, hard to get nowadays which Allegro Non Tropa is like 89 bucks on Amazon, which is costed $90 these days, which is a collectible item. Unless you want to get the VHS from RCA Columbia Home Video, and same with the English dub, and again from RCA Columbia on Laserdisc. That's the reason why. Here's the DVD extras. Like, let's move on to the Blu-ray of Mad Max: The Road Warrior. Next, I'm going to put in is my Blu-ray disc of The Road Warrior. Let's see how this tested out. Because we take a look on the DVD of Legro Non Tropo on this PS4. It does play DVDs and Blu-rays. Let's see what the Blu-ray of The Road Warrior does. If, if it's blank and it's a Blu-ray, just like the DVD on it. But let's find out if it says it. Nope. It just shows the title where it says Mad Max 2, The Road Warrior on it. And it shows the the picture of Mel Gibson as Max Rokotansky in it. And see what how this plays on your game system, which is your PlayStation 4. That's the reason why I have to do this tutorial on how I show you how to put DVDs and Blu-rays into your game system, which is my PlayStation 4. Here's the little Warner Home Video logo. You click on the Blu-ray features thing. Yeah. Which I'll probably show you on the Blu-ray menu through Quick Guide on the, at one point on the Road Warrior on Blu-ray at one point. Well, just showing you how it does. Just a quick one I'm doing. And there shows scene selections on it on your if you want to and let cuz I really do want to get as a Blu-ray player at one point. So the thing about putting DVDs and Blu-rays into your PlayStation 4, like, this is the one I have as my PlayStation 4 jet black one. If you haven't seen my unboxing of my PlayStation 4 jet black one, I'll probably put the link in the description box down below if you want to check that video out at, at one point. If you want, I'll probably put the link in the description box. If, if I want, whenever I feel like. So for the thing about 
the differences between putting DVDs and a Blu-ray in your PlayStation 4, this is like probably more different from converting your DVDs into your iPod, uh, for example, like iPod Touch, iPhone, and iPod Video. Why do I keep mentioning Apple products? Anyways, that's probably more different. Probably converting from VHS to DVD also. That's the reason about converting and all. And you get the point because this is my new tutorial on my of how I show you how I put my DVD and Blu-rays into your PlayStation 4. When I first put in a DVD on this PlayStation 4, it shows DVD disc logo thing, and it says DVD. And then you press play on it. It does play, and it really do play DVD player ease on this PlayStation 4. Now that I know, same with the Blu-rays. If you put a Blu-ray player of your, but a Blu-ray disc of your favorite. For example, in genre, if you, your favorite TV show or your movie, probably anime too, it shows the picture of the, the title on it, and it says the name on the title of your on your Blu-ray disc. That's the thing. So that's going to be it for my tutorial on how to put DVDs and Blu-rays into your PlayStation 4 tutorial video, you guys. So thanks for watching, but before we go, so the thing about putting your Blu-ray and DVD into your game systems like your PlayStation 4. This is like the equivalent to converting your VHS tapes to DVDs on your computer, as well as converting your DVDs to your iPod. Uh, that's the thing. What's next? Converting Blu-rays to your iPhone X or Maybe I'll probably look into it when I see some videos on that out there at one point. Hope to subscribe for content. My anime plan link in the description down below. You can share this video on your Twitter. If you have Twitter account, you can share this video on your Facebook. If you have Facebook account, if you can share this video on your Facebook with your friends on Facebook, please click on my subscribe button on my YouTube channel. Become a subscriber to Rurouni K95. And then you click on the notifications bell button. See what I posted some latest videos on YouTube. As a where I uploaded a new video today. Like, subscribe, favorite, comment, share on social media pages like Facebook, Twitter, etc. Click on the notif please sure to click on the subscribe button and click on the notifications bell. Read what I upload my latest video today on YouTube. And that's it. So because I did my tutorial video. I'm going to do this video. That's the latest, newest one I haven't done in a while since Monday. This is Rony King 95 I hope you like this video. I hope you enjoy it. Hope to see you soon. This is Rony King 95 signing off.